Hi, I'm Marcus. If you're going to be towing with your Honda Accord, you're going to need some trailer wiring. It's required by law. Let's go ahead and get to that install. You'll need the tools seen here to complete this installation. For this four pole wiring, we're going to be remaining in the trunk. Um, so first thing, just make sure your trunk is empty. We'll go ahead and bring up this panel here. We'll go ahead and remove this panel here just by pulling up on it. I'm going to set that aside for later. Next, we'll go ahead and remove these pins here, as well as these two here. That way we can peel back this carpet and get to our wiring behind the taillight. Next, we're going to go ahead and do the same process on the passenger side. Next, we'll go ahead and peel back this carpet here, and we're going to find the plugs that match our matching connectors on the wiring harness. Now we're going to go ahead and push in on this tab back here and pull our harness out. And now we'll go ahead and get this turn signal harness out. Same thing. Push down on that tab and pull out. Now we'll go ahead and match up the plugs and plug the, our new harness in. Now we'll go ahead and take the factory vehicle wiring and plug it into our adapter harness. And now we'll go ahead and route our passenger side harness along the factory wiring. We went ahead and pulled our carpet back on the passenger side. We're going to go ahead and remove the plug on this side. We'll go ahead and plug in our harness to the factory wiring and then we'll plug in our T-connector harness into the vehicle's taillight. Back on the driver's side here, we just need to connect our ground. We're going to install ours right here with a provided self-tapper screw. We went ahead and routed our wiring behind our carpet here and have put it back. Now we're going to go ahead and reinstall the interior. Now we'll go ahead and repeat that process on the passenger side. Now we're going to go ahead and reinstall this panel here. And for the storage of our harness, we have two different options. You can go out of a grommet through the, the back of the car here. Otherwise, you could also bring it out and close the trunk on it whenever you need to use it and then store it inside whenever you're not using it. On this one we'll be storing it inside our spare tire well underneath our trunk cover. If you have any questions about the product seen in this video or if you'd like to schedule installation with a U-Haul hitch professional visit us online today at uhaulhitches.com.